President Tay Fernandez once again come to the defense of his vice president and leader of his party, Barra Jagdio, following questions from members of the United Nations Human Rights Commission on why an investigation was not conducted into allegations of corruption leveled against Jagdio. In a statement on Newsroom, President Ali accused the opposition of being behind the questions. As quoted in a Newsroom article, President Ali said the UN committee member who put forward the question was obviously fed with the propaganda of the opposition operatives. He went on to say that the questions were made to paint his government in a negative light. Further, Ali was quoted as saying what the opposition does is to find conduits through which their messaging can infiltrate international institutions. In this case, try to use this individual position to derail the two days of positive review Guyana had at the committee itself. As a government, we are committed to upholding the high value of every institution of the UN and will continue to actively participate. Government Minister Gail Teixeira led the team virtually before the United Nations Human Rights Committee to answer a series of concerns raised by the committee members. Teixeira told the committee that an investigation was not launched into the allegations leveled against the Vice President Barack Jagdio as there was not a report made to the police. The issue of the Vice News accusation of a Vice News report article on the Vice President of Guyana and acts of corruption. There is no follow up on it because there was no police uh, report made by Vice News or anybody else. And so the police cannot investigate without some form of report of complaint. However, the Vice President has answered this issue publicly several times in the same media that has carried these reports. In a piece published by Vice News, Diana Vassil, Vice President Bar Jagdio, was accused of accepting bribes from Chinese businessmen in exchange for large contracts.